What's up dudes and dudettes? Welcome back to Empire. Today, I got the bobber. Ooh boy. Ooh wow, that oh, it feels much different. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that seat, oh, that's even, that's even more cuppier than the street triple. Let's go for a ride. Oh, there's the pegs. <laughs> I'm so used to being on a forward leaning bike. Thanks are up there. So let's see what we got here. So we got a fuel gauge, fuel meter right here. You got your tack, your gear indicator. I personally don't really care for it, but you know, sometimes it's nice to know what gear you're in. Sure wish I could hear the sound of the bike a bit better. My ears are all plugged because of allergies. Everything's kind of muffled, kind of sucks. But uh, you know what, we're, uh, I have to do some shifting maneuvers here. And just like that, very nice. So the right position is actually not bad. I, this is comfortable. I feel like I'm in a chair, actually. Just a chair that cuts your butt. So funny thing about the bobber is it's not it's technically not a real bobber. It looks like a bobber, but the shock is actually hidden underneath the seat. So they did a real good job of getting the uh, bobber look while also keeping it nice and comfortable for you, for your spine and your butt. Ooh, it's got a nice kick. Even with this like low, low sitting position, the sandal's really nice. I mean, that quarter was super easy. But the styling on this, this is pretty nice. And it's got the uh, more my style master cylinder, which it's kind of cool. I don't like those open little jar looking things. Uh, I don't like being behind big trucks. I can't see what's in front of me. Yeah, it's got a nice pickup. Pretty good corners right here. So we're going at about 45. Nice and smooth. So I get a little faster. Very smooth. This is fun. I like this. I like how it has the dial for your speedometer. That's kind of a trait in a bike that I like. It, it, it gives it a classic, classic feel to it. Just the detail of this bike is, it's nice. Man, you just go through the gears. I believe this is the Bobber Black Edition. Makes sense. Everything's black. Okay. By the way, welcome to SCC. This is where I go to college. This isn't my campus though. My campus is a secret campus. <laughs> Man, this is, this is a really fun bike. I like this. I, it feels like I'm, <laughs> it feels like I'm riding on a, on a, on a, on a lazy boy chair. <laughs> That's why I kick my feet out and just, ah. Uh. <laughs> No, seriously, this is this is comfy. And if you're into this kind of style of bike, I don't think you'll be disappointed. I'm six foot two, and this is this is comfortable. This is a comfortable ride height. Yeah, today is just a nice, nice day. Hey, do you want to take Fancher? No, I don't. I don't want to take Fancher. And this is light too, like very nicely balanced. So far, no complaints about this bike. The styling is amazing. The seat position's 
very comfortable. No digital display, which I appreciate. The mirrors are very classic, very classic looking. That's the nice thing about these new, new Triumphs is they're classic looking, but also very modern looking. Not very modern looking, but they also look classic. That's what's, that's what's nice about these new Triumphs. Yeah, if there wasn't so many cars around me, I test out the ABS, but I don't feel like getting rear-ended. But just like all the other new Triumphs, this has what is called clutch assist and ride by wire. I'm personally not a fan of it because I like old mechanical stuff. That's just a preference, but it's smooth. Like it's, it's really smooth. And that's what's kind of amazing is just, it is, it is much smoother. So if you want smoother shifting, smoother, whatever, this has it. I keep thinking that's the peg, but it's not the uh, kickstand. I keep putting my foot on the kickstand. I'm not used to having my feet forward like this, but it's comfortable. It's a comfortable position. Wow, just let, let the guy over. The suspension is kind of stiff. I'll give it that. When I was out on Trent, I was getting a little kind of thing going on. Even though it doesn't shift like my threats in or the street triple or the speed twin, it shifts really freaking well. And all these cars are gonna go. Well, anyways, this was a very fun bike. Uh, my butt's actually getting a little... <laughs> I think it's falling asleep. <laughs> it's a stiff seat, but... Hey, if you're looking for a bike like this, that's kind of classic looking, kind of mean looking, but also very sweet looking, buddy, this is the bike for you. And if you're into Triumphs, that's a plus. Let's get this turned in. Uh, try to watch out for that. Ah, uh, good. Put it back where it belongs because that's what you do. You put it back where it belongs. So turn it off. Put it in first so it doesn't roll forward. And, oh yeah, keys out over here. And there you folks have it. Very nice. I like the ride. Well, if you're looking for this bike, yeah, come on out and check it out. Thanks for watching. Big thanks to my friends at Empire. I'll see you guys next time.